So it's currently 6.58 a.m. And uh, today we're gonna do some flying at the Beamer in Flat Rock. Check this place out. Beautiful morning. Wow. I was not expecting waves like this. It's coming over the dock and everything. Headed out onto the Beamer now. Beautiful spot. I just want to bring us up to the top here. There's a few old military bunkers that I think would make a good lift off spot. Pretty icy this morning. So as you can see, we made it to the bunker, which is pretty cool. But check this out. Wow. It's not very windy at all, so I was not expecting waves like this. What a fantastic morning. About 12 kilometers northwest of the capital city of St. John's lies the little town of Flat Rock, Newfoundland. It's named after one of the most striking landmarks on the Avalon Peninsula. Reaching a whopping 1.2 kilometers out into the Atlantic Ocean, the Beamer is truly awesome. It slopes out of the bay in the northwest, abruptly dropping as much as 60 meters into the sea. In the summer, local rock climbers enjoy scaling dozens of anchored routes up the Don Wall. The thing about filming in Newfoundland is that you wait for weeks to get triple sevens and have a sunny day with very little wind and no rain. But even then, you still need a dry bag for your stuff because everything is just covered in moisture. But that's it. It's worth it. waters in Flat Rock are beautiful but dangerous. Signage in the area urges caution and for good reason. Three people have lost their lives here in the past five years. Whether you enjoy the view safely from the road or take the 8.9 kilometer hike along Father Troy's trail from nearby Torbay, the Beamer is well worth checking out.
got some big rocks here too. 